Hello and uh, welcome back to my videos. In this video we want to speak about the Python and Django framework and today we want to speak about how you can use the Jinja uh, template framework inside Django. It's pretty easy and after this video if you want to know more I have a, a lot of videos about uh, Jinja so you can just go inside my channel and find it in the playlist. I will try to put this inside the description below so you always can find my other videos. So that's what we're gonna do today and I really hope you want to stay here and, and see the full video and of course then I hope you want to subscribe so you can get more videos from me and if you have any questions or feedback you can smash the comments below and really hope you want to like and share this video too. So let's begin to code something. So the first we're gonna do now is set the post and we want to create uh, some file called the uh, HTML file and it should be in the folder templates and we can call it main uh, my post Django ginger template for Django and then we say hello world nope we just say block content and uh, then we gonna do what in block down below here whoops and then we just say if everything here we can say uh, content template block missing please fill out and that's it then we have the template and we are good to go to the next template. The next template we want to do now, it's uh, one more, we can call it a post detail. And we don't need this. We will uh, make an extension of this. Extends main.html and then we just going inside and say and block content uh, and block and then we say detail view and what's to say h1 and then we just say page number something like that uh, page number we can say just number view number I don't build the page now and then we basically just going back for the views now and uh, we have the views here and what we are gonna do now it's uh, the detail side here and uh, we need to say render request and then uh, we need the post detail that HTML and we need to fill inside the same number number is equal to number and let's try that out I think that will work as it should be and yes you can see I can I can put a little bit down again and then you can see we have it here so that's how the, the ginger uh, working inside the Django and of course I want to create one more up here with the index so we can say uh, posts uh, post list let's call it the post list and we don't send anything inside and we just copy this and call it post list and list uh, of all the blog posts thanks for watching this and then we can go back and uh, I think that's pretty good if I just remove this one and uh, now it's working so thank you for staying here with me today and I really hope you want to subscribe to this channel I really appreciate that and if you have any questions please make the comments below I'll try to answer them as fast as possible. 
don't forget to like and share and of course not forget to subscribe to this channel. Thank you so much and hope to see you next time. Bye.